Hello, my friends. Stop. The Dutchman went by here. Yes. It's time. Pink Floyd. Comfortably numb. Pulse. A live version, so to say. <laughs> uh, suggested by Shane Hargis, The Escort, Jonesy Wales, Sky1206, THP, BGC Bread, EMP in Brasilio, Simon Hall, Jimmy Jam, Rielva, Andy Bras, Tommy Johnson, Alain A, Gerald Herman, Frank Ferdinand, Steve Chesney, Chris C, Super Ruffy, Starfour, to zero, Eric, Mikom, Jason Williams, Real Science, Kosan Hansens, Agutwa, Rudy Asaf. They all suggest uh, this track. Fury Valentine, 911, 911. Iemand anders, Gabo Lujan. The list goes on and on. Here we go, my friends. I've been looking forward to this.
Ja, het was oké. Okay. Almost 10 minutes, a little bit long. Too long. <laughs> that was one of the best guitar solos of all time. Oh, that was out of this world. Magnifique. Fantastisch. Wunderbar. Um, man, did this was... <laughs> yeah, everything uh, I say right now is, you know, would sound corny. This was so absolutely monumental. I know a lot of you have suggested this particular version. I can't understand why. Because this was absolutely mind blowing and, and again, one of the best solos I've ever heard in my entire life. Just, just the entire solo just told the story. It was just so emotional, it told the story with so much emotion. Often with, you know, with those guitar players, those technical uh, metal uh, players who are talented as heck. But it, 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 it often lacks emotion. It doesn't tell a, a story, if, if you understand what I'm saying. And this does. This can really take you in, into another dimension, another world, another time, another place, you name it. Absolutely stunning. Yes, Pink Floyd. Got a lot of catching up to do. Alive. It's so much fun. Yeah. I know a lot of people, I've seen some other videos, some people have that with Queen or with the Stones or whatever, or with Metallica or whatever. I have that big with Pink Floyd, I have that with Rush. Um, it, it, it really is a journey. And, and I've said this many times before, but later never. <laughs> but I think this uh, particular rendition was... Uh, as I said, it's not, uh, not a coincidence. So many of you have suggested this particular, uh, this particular moment in their career. Absolutely fantastic. It's just so. You listen to it. You, you, you don't have to you watch the play, you just have to listen to it. And it, 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 it really does something with you. It, does, it did something with it. It absolutely did something with me. 10 out of 10. My friends, uh, thanks so much for introducing me to Pink, to, to Pink Floyd, to, the, to suggesting this particular uh, live uh, version. I love it. Maybe you did not realize that until now. <laughs> Absolutely spectacular. Wonder what more they, do, uh, they have in store for me. We're gonna find out in the next couple of weeks, months, years, whatever. We will see. I hope you liked it as much as I did. Maybe you did not, and maybe you never heard this version before. You know, maybe you're ignorant and stupid like me. <laughs> nah, silly joke. Thanks so much, my friends. I, uh, I'm blown away. Maybe you could, uh, maybe you could not tell. Thanks so much. Hope you liked this video. Let me know what you guys think. If you like this video, click on the like button, subscribe if you like what I do, follow me on Facebook and Instagram. You can also support me on Patreon, that would be awesome. I promise I will do this for the rest of my life. See you soon. Bye-bye.